Hello everyone. This is Docker Captain Nipendra Khare and I would be sharing a Docker tip with you. We'll talk about Docker execution drivers. Before Docker 0.9 release, Docker used to use LXC to access the Linux kernel features like control groups, namespaces to create the containers. With Docker 0.9 release, Docker introduced execution driver APIs and the lib container. With execution driver APIs, Docker can now use different isolation technologies like libvirt, system DNS spawn, so as zones to create containers. Lib container became part of the Docker engine through which we can directly access the Linux kernel features to create the containers. In Docker 1.11 release, Docker introduced Container D, which can now run and manage all the OCI compliant Run C containers. With that, Docker has taken away the management of the containers from the Docker engine, which can now allow us to restart and upgrade the Docker engine without worrying about restarting of our containers. Container D works as a daemon on Linux and Windows system which can manage the entire life cycle of the containers. It is very evolving and very interesting project to work on. If you want to know more about Containerd, then join us at DockerCon this April in Austin.